post office in the Castle Hill section of the Bronx. Are they part of what the U.S. Postal Service says is a routine removal of redundant or seldom used collection boxes because of a decline in letters and flat mail? Mail Handlers Union Local 300 President Kevin Taberas. The mailbox is away. I really didn't get a straight answer from anybody yet. The Trump administration is facing accusations of intentionally crippling the U.S. Postal Service to interfere with the upcoming election. The president defended his handpicked U.S. Postmaster General, Louis DeJoy, who changed policies to trim the budget by banning overtime and added trips to deliver the mail. He's a very talented man. He's a brilliant business person. He's done great. Tabaris disagrees. Now we're seeing mail get delayed. Congressional Democrats, including New York Senator Chuck Schumer, claim DeJoy's changes are causing nationwide delays. The Postal Service warned mail-in ballots in all 50 states may not be received by election offices in time to be counted. The House Oversight Committee is calling on DeJoy to testify in an emergency hearing. We should stamp him with return to sender if he won't appear before the hearing. White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows insisted the president is not using the Postal Service to impact the election. I'll give you that guarantee right now. The president of the United States is not going to interfere with anybody casting their, their vote in a legitimate way, whether it's the post office or anything else. Responding to concerns, the Postal Service says it's now postponing the removal of collection boxes for a period of 90 days. The White House says USPS will also suspend its plan to remove hundreds of machines used to postmark and sort mail until after the election. Everybody should have, you know, be able to vote and their vote should be counted. And we'd love to be able to do that without being uh, uh, strangled by uh, Washington, D.C. President Trump said he'd consider giving the Postal Service more funding in a coronavirus relief bill, but he says Democrats are holding it up. The House is expected to reconvene on Saturday to address all the Postal Service problems. In Midtown, Hazel Sanchez, CBS 2 News.